Hello and welcome to Capital TV News. I'm Angela Wamboy, and these are the stories making headlines. The Director of Public Prosecutions, Kiriako Tobiko, has told the Senate Committee on Legal Affairs and Human Rights that political interference is a big impediment to the prosecution of corruption cases. Tobiko says his office has been put under intense pressure by politicians who have even threatened to slash his office budget should things not go their way. He says his office has also come under pressure from tribal groups who are opposed to the prosecution of one of their own. He's however adamant that his office has maintained its integrity despite the difficulty in diplomacy handling such persons. Musalia Mudavidi has formally quit the United Democratic Forum Party, which sponsored him in the 2013 presidential election in which he lost. Capital Newsbeat has seen a letter he wrote to the party's secretary general announcing his resignation. In the letter, Mudavidi says he voluntarily resigned and wishes the party well in its future endeavors. His private secretary, Kibisu Kabatesi, says Musalia has now joined the Amani National Congress, which will sponsor him in the 2017 general election. The new party is gearing towards a major recruitment drive ahead of the formal launch later this year. The High Court has lifted an order freezing the accounts of City Hall Finance Director Jimmy Mutuku Kiamba. Justice Bogoli Masaga has ruled that the Ethics and Anti-Corruption Commission did not provide sufficient evidence to show that the 123 million shillings in his accounts were obtained fraudulently. The judge also faulted the anti-graft body for failing to serve Kiamba with freeze order as required by law and also enjoined his wife and their firm who are not party to the matter. And that's your Capital TV News Update. I'm Angela Wamboy. For more on these and other stories, make sure you subscribe and like our YouTube channel at Capital FM Kenya.